what is up guys, Inside here with my very first episode of Indie Spotlight. Um, now I've been wanting to start the series because there are a lot of indie games on the eShop that I don't feel like get enough attention, or at least there were on past Nintendo consoles. So I wanted to start um, doing it with the Switch, so hopefully we could um, bring to light these pretty good games. Now, I know this might be a surprise to you guys, <clears throat> but I'm actually doing Owl Boy rather than Celeste, which you saw on my, I think it was the intro I made for my last video. I was thinking about it right before I was buying it, and I saw Owl Boy, and it looked actually, to me at least, a little bit better, and it looked more interesting to do it on. So yeah, we're doing it on Owl Boy. Um, this is my first time playing it, so I guess we're just gonna get right into it with a new game. Okay, so I guess our character's um, name is Otis. Uh, I guess I'll be talking through and reading this stuff now. I don't know. So, no need to look so nervous. <clears throat> this is a great moment for you. Despite being born as a mute under my tutelage, I'm guessing that's like tutoring or something, you'll become one of the pillars of our community. So, yeah, it's at $25. So, yeah, it's a pretty hefty price point for an indie game. But the art looks amazing so far. And it seems pretty good from what I've seen of it. Um, so apparently right now we are picking up water for someone. With, okay. Uh, I don't know if he, if they cut to Otis being a better flyer or not, but. Uh, not really sure what's happening right now. He's checking if there's any water left, so. Ooh. Dude, I'm gonna mess this up. Pfft. Rip. We are outside. Um, I'm not sure how to pronounce that. Veli or something like that. Okay, but basically, I think this is like a training ground, from what I understand. I guess fly through these like vine things. Yeah. Seems simple enough. Dude, we just died. So yeah, so far the controls are pretty good. Uh. Oof. Guess we get some money for flying through these. Dude, Otis is pretty ripped. So he's saying that we're an unstoppable team and he's trying to fix the cannon. So I guess this is actually the village. Uh, I didn't really read that text before, so I'm not really sure what we're doing. Let's just grab some of these blocks out. What the heck? Dude, this guy's pretty weird looking. Let's talk to him. Looking for pirates. Okay, so I think he said to look for pirates. I remember him talking about pirates earlier. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna steal your bongos. Dude, keep bongoing. Bongoing? Is that even a word? Interesting. Maybe pirates? Or not. Dude, we just got owned by that owl guy. Fib and Bonicky or something. Dude, these guys are like making fun of him. That's pretty rude. At least we got this this kind boy over here. Okay. I guess now we're learning what that is. Oh, so maybe that means we can pick him up now like I saw in the trailer. I don't know. Okay, yeah, so it looks like we're not gonna have like a total of maybe either three or six people we can get throughout the game. I guess um, if you look at the top, uh, Getty, which is that guy's name, is actually considered an item. So, um, I guess we can like shoot now. Whoa. Dude, this is gonna get pretty. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't. <laughs> Dude, I didn't even know that could happen. Oh, it's okay. He can fly. We're all good. I think he's talking about some sort of like amazing map or something he made, uh, but it just completely backfired. Dude, oh, but the old the old guy's cool. He lets us be in here. But dude, why are you wearing a book on your head? I mean, are you all right? Oh, okay. I guess we were. Dude, there are those two freaking jerks that are just bullying everyone. Dude, we need to go catch them. And beat him up. No, seriously. Okay, we're back at like this shrine thing. Now we have like this snow owl or something. Um, 
I'm not really sure what we're supposed to do anymore. What the? I'm not really sure if someone just jumped down onto us or we just got... We just witnessed a first-hand murder. Wait, never mind. This white owl guy is, like, dead. What are we doing? Wait, oh, I need to take this guy with me. Oh, I saw him, I saw him. Dude, we're gonna beat him up. I think that's a pirate. Boom. Dude, look how fast we're going. Dude, now this green guy's actually not useless. Okay, we got him, we got him. Simple chase scene right here. Oh, our first enemies. Oh, jeez. I did not see that guy. Oh my gosh. Dude, yep. dude, am I seriously gonna die right now? Okay, that was pretty, pretty pathetic. Um, so it looks like we can't really get to him through here. I don't know why he doesn't keep running. Uh, I guess we can only step on this as an owl. So that's pretty odd. I think we can go over here. Yeah, okay. Cool, there are little hidden rooms. Dude, I'm like already almost dead. Is that an no, that's not an enemy. Oh, jeez. Dude, we just died. Wait, oh, okay, I thought we could just get through there. I was like shooting at that freak. Ever. Um, can okay, I guess that's just like an enemy spawner. We can't get over there either. Oh, rocks. I'm not really sure what we can do with those, but... Oh, can this like somehow knock it down? Boom. What the heck? That actually doesn't really make much sense, but... Oh well. Okay, I guess... Can we not... Yeah, I don't think we can... Okay, so I'm gonna get that guy over there and completely abandon him for a rock. And take him back now. Dude, I'm not sure what's more valuable at this point, a rock or him. Oof. Dude, the storyline thickens. Okay, what the? Dude, I thought that guy got crushed. Oh. Oh, wait. Uh, Otis is mute, though, so we can't really tell him if he's okay. So he's probably not going to know that he's safe. I guess we're on our own now. Okay, never mind. I guess we got it. I don't know why that wasn't working. I guess uh, we can only stun them. Uh-oh. What the heck? Dude, literally, this guy can fly. This guy can dig. I have no idea how he did that, but... Boom. Dude, we're gonna catch this guy pretty soon. I don't know why he waits for us to catch up to him. Oh, wait. Easy puzzle right here. We can just leave that guy behind. See ya. He's probably just gonna dig another hole anyways. Uh, oh, wait. Never mind. That's what we're supposed to do. I think we can take this thing back here and grab our friend again. There we go. That worked out pretty easily. Do you guys like that? <laughs> okay, I already know what to do because we freaking screwed it up the first time. So, okay, this first time we can, like, beat this guy up. I wonder if we can, like, take him into the air with us. So, so, okay, let's try to- Oh! 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 Wait, no, we can't- Ah! Oh. We just sucked it up. Okay. Okay, yeah, first phase is done. That was pretty easy. I don't know how it even took any damage. Uh, now this phase... Who? Okay, there we go. Uh, we got him. Just keep shooting. Okay. I think I got it this time. I'm feeling good. Boom, boom. Okay. Oh, what? We, we got too... We got too close to that guy. We were too excited to beat him. Boom. 
Oh, whoa, he literally needed one more shot and he'd be dead. I bet this guy's gonna turn happy in the background. Never mind. Dude, there's that guy. I don't know how he got behind us or how we got in front of him. Dude, wait, that was a spider? Um. Whoa, this is actually pretty cool. I bet I can go boom and hit him. Oh, never mind. Okay. Dude, what is he doing? I guess he's giving that to the professor or something. Oh. Our first relic, I guess. Owls? Dude, wow! This guy isn't even loyal. He's just gonna back away so we can die. What the? Dude, literally, this guy can teleport and dig holes. Okay, so I guess it got dark. Maybe we were just, like, in there for so long, but... Dude, like, is this entire island... Oh, never mind, pirates. Oh, wait, never mind. I bet this is gonna be, um... I bet this is gonna be, like, a wind waker sort of thing. There we go! Now he's gone in the in the clouds forever. Okay, how did he even get in here? I guess the solution to everything is to kick it really hard. I think that actually does work sometimes though. So what was his great invention? An earthquake making machine. Dude, that must be like that lead pirate or something. Um. So they're saying that we led them right to the relic. But I thought we got the relic. I guess we just got a clicker. Dude, I wonder what the real relic was. Okay, I guess his system seems to be working now. <clears throat> oh, so it tracks the pirate ships, I guess. So they're leaving. And they're gone, I think. Town meeting at once. Well, guys, I think this is probably going to have to end it. Uh, this seems like a pretty good ending point for this very first episode. Um, I may have another one out, but yeah, this is um, a pretty fun game so far. I know we're kind of still in the tutorial a bit, but yeah, so right now we're having a town meeting, seeing if anyone's okay. Yeah, it's pretty much it, but yeah, so let's just go over a few things. The game is $25, which is quite a bit for an indie game. Um, so far, I think it's almost made back its money, um, but I'm not quite sold on it yet. Uh, so yeah, I'll have another video of this out probably pretty soon, um, just showing off stuff after the tutorial. That's probably going to be more interesting. I forgot to mention, um, make sure you do yourself a favor and join our Discord server. It's a really good server. We had... Um, someone by the name of, I think they're like Spikes with a couple numbers afterward. Um, they really decked out the server adding bots and stuff and that was really cool. So I'll leave a link to his YouTube channel in the description. Make sure to go check it out. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it for the video. I'll have a Mario Odyssey challenge video up next and see you guys later, I guess.